Hey guys, today I'm going to show you some pretty good raffles here in the underwater biome. So here we are at raffle number one. Here's the map. Here's the cords. I guess there, there's not really anything to look for. I guess if you're right here, if you see this crack in the ceiling, there's like some tubes around. There's like this... I, I, I guess you, it's like directly underneath this tube and if you just head straight up here it's a uh, it's a mesh hole. so I, I wouldn't recommend building here it's gonna get patched sooner or later if you do go far up enough uh, you will die it's a uh, it's a good uh, good spot it's pretty flat it goes pretty far back but it's a uh, it is a mesh hole. so if you do find someone building in here uh, Tell the admins or something, since it, but I, I mean, I guess it's rateable. It, it has a, it's hard to find, but you do have a, a fairly decent sized hole. You could probably gas bag, gas bag, uh, soak this. But yeah, that's uh base location number one. And let's head to two. All right, guys. So here we are at base location number two. Here's the map. Here's the cords. Um, I guess it's like towards the edge of the underwater biome. If you find this thing over here, I don't know what you would call these things. Well, platforms. Yeah, it's towards the end. And uh, it's towards the end. Uh, you have uh, Leoplordons over here. So if you, you are looking for them, uh, they spawn right here, which are pretty helpful. Uh, not only do you have insane drops here in Genesis 2, if you have a Leoplordon, uh, buff, uh, <laughs> they get a lot better. Like, a whole lot better. Uh, but here's the cords, and to, it's towards the end again, and the spot is up here. It's a little crack in the wall, and you do have, uh, this amount of space over here. It's, um... It's a, it's a decent size for a solo. You could easily defend it. Small entrance. Just have like a, a couple turrets. Like maybe a turret right here. Turret up there. Just just hanging off. And you, should, you should be fine. They, I don't think a gas bag can soak this since it's uh, such a small crack. But if you do go up here. You do have a fairly decent size. You can build here in uh, unofficial and official. I do have official sending, and by the way, at the top left corner of the screen, I'm going to have, if you could build in official or unofficial, just so you guys uh, know it better, and I will leave, uh, like, time skips underneath uh, the comment sections and in the descriptions telling you uh, to to go to, like, base location number one and two, uh, just so it's easier and you guys can skip to the parts where you are interested in, but other than that, this is base location number two. Now let's head to three. All right, here we are at base location number two. I mean, number three. Here's the map. Here are the cords. I'm pretty sure this is like Sneaky Beagle's, uh, Bagel's, Beagle's uh, spot. It's a, it's a fairly decent size. It's super flat over here. I guess it's pretty easy to defend. If you do have Bassies, I guess you could suck with the Bassies. Uh, but you also have this like uh, crack up on here. You could you could place a triangle foundations like I did, or you could place your like tech generator up here. You could build your own official, by the way. It's uh, you could put indie forges. You have this upper area. You have a lot of space, and it's a pretty solid spot. I get, uh, at least to start off in, but it's um, it's worth uh, worth taking since it's uh, people usually don't come here in, uh, for the underwater area only to tame like uh i guess two cells and other stuff but um uh, it's uh it's decent to start off with the only hard part i guess is to get materials in and out of your base but other than that it's uh it's, it's good i was had uh base location number four all right guys so here we are at base location number four here's the map here are the cords and it's Basically the same as uh, the last uh, base spot. I think it might be a little better. 
you do have this upper area. Maybe you'd be able to fit a cliff plat. I don't know. I don't know if you'll be able to. Maybe it's like obstructed. Yeah, it, you might be able to. Not sure, but if uh, it's good for unofficial, if you can place like a cliff plat there and have like uh, some of your dinos uh, on top. And then you also have this this crack up on top. You can place like your tech jenny over here or up there. Uh, you have uh, you have a lot of room. Indie forges, uh, reps. Uh, pretty easy to defend since you just had to defend like I guess the front side. It is a big entrance, but it's uh, it's worth taking. You have this area also over here, and uh, yeah, it's, it's just basically the same as the last one. You can build it the same way. I think this one's a little better. It is bigger and it's uh, more secretive. You do have like this entire like room, so take that for what you will. So that's number four. Let's go to five. All right, here we are, number five. Here's the map. Here's the cords. To find this place, I guess it's towards the edge. You have this pipe that goes around. Uh, but this is also another mesh roll, so be careful building in here. Same problem with the first mesh roll. Go up far enough, you die. And you do have this uh, back area up here, over here, but it's uh, I do not recommend building in here. But uh, I do feel like I should show you guys all the uh, rat holes I find, and hopefully uh, Ark patches these rat holes since they're clearly not here and they won't be uh, here for a, uh, they won't last here. So uh, it's uh, it's not safe. They are starting to patch more rat holes and more mesh uh, mesh holes, so uh, you gotta be careful with that. You have this crack. It's uh, they can only attack from this side, so I guess you can build like a turret wall over here. They can suck with bastis, rock golems, but like if you're playing on official, they can't suck with rock golems since uh, you can't get them here. Yeah, uh, so, 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 yeah. That's uh, basic issue number five. All right, guys, this is the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, uh, leave a like, uh, leave a comment. If you think uh, if there's any other underwater rat holes that I should know about, I know that one that's in here that's like a an actual baseball. I already showed that in like the first video I've made. Uh, in base locations, so I'm not gonna show it again. If you guys do want to see it, go over to the the first one I've made on Genesis 2. It is the first video I made on Genesis 2, so you guys can look at that. Here's the course one more time. Subscribe if you haven't already. Again, I am posting daily content. More rat hosts will come. I have so many more, and I'm also planning on releasing a series. I'm so so look forward to that I might make a discord soon not sure it's just I don't think anyone's interested in that other than like a very few people so I'll con I'll consider it but I am in the road to 200 subscribers I just need to about 20 more at the time of recording this I have 180 subscribers so if you do guys want to be like I guess I don't know. If you guys want to be like OGs, then you should subscribe now. And I'll make a Discord. I'll, I'll, I'll announce it when I release it. I'll give you guys the OG usernames, like OG tags that you can get in uh, Discord. So, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed. Other than that, I'll see you guys in the next one.